Hi guys! Hello family! This is a wonderful day that the Lord has made. Trust you guys are awesome. Trust you guys are well and warm. And very warm because it's cold out there. Um, for those who are tuning in for the first time, welcome to the family. Um, hope you're going to stay and you're going to invite others. Um, in case um, someone has forgotten or in case someone feels left out, I just want to remind you that God cares about you. He still cares. He never stopped. He's our father. He's our good father. He's our good shepherd. He never left. He's forever with us. And it's just a reminder that God cares about you. Ne? Let's read this. The book of Isaiah chapter 46 verse number 4. It reads, <clears throat> sorry, I am your God and will take care of you until you are old and your hair is gray. Oh, but tuna. I made you and will care for you. I will give you help and rescue you. To whom will you compare me, says the Lord. <clears throat> Sorry. Is there anyone else like me? I just love this verse. Can I read it again, please? I am your God and will take care of you until you're old and your hair is gray. I made you and will care for you. I will give you help and rescue you. To whom will you compare me, says the Lord. Is there anyone else like me? Definitely no. Definitely not. So this is another promise that we are being given or are being told by God that he will definitely take care of us until our hair is gray. Until we are old. So it's an everlasting thing. I stop. I stop it the feelings. I stop it because of Fraser DB. I stop it because of, you know, our feelings or emotions. No. He cares for us. Each and every single one of us. And each and every single day, God cares. And when he cares, he will rescue us. He will take care of us. He will take care of you. It's a promise. And God is a promise keeper. Yeah, this verse is, it, it just blessed me. And I thought I should share it with you, family. That be reminded that you are loved. Be reminded that you are special. Be, remind, be reminded that there is someone who is bigger than anything else. Who loves you. Who cares about you. Who sees you, who sees everything that you are going through and irregardless of everything that you are going through, he still cares and he's watching. Like, you know, in times we tend to forget our God. We tend to forget who God is when we encounter um situation. We even limit him. Like, there's nothing that God cannot do for us. So we tend to limit him. We tend to we tend to say that ah this one we'll see if God does it. So you know in my journey <clears throat> I've learned that it is only our faith and it is only our trust that can make God do things for us. That will make God um show up or answer us. It is faith. And believing in God. You know, once you believe in God, then He shows up. Once you trust in God, He shows up. So I've learned that, okay, if I believe, then obviously I'm going to pray, but I'm not believing. So that thing won't come. Again. But if I believe, cares. if I believe that His ways are higher than my ways, if I believe that His plans are and not to harm me, but to prosper me. If I believe and have faith that he will surely um, come at the right time, if I have faith in that, if I believe in that, 
then God shows up because he's not a man that he would lie. And his word is, is alive, active. And a mudimu kimudu maratang attention in a guy's in. Or at attention, or if umuts help, umu believe a lady, and then who it can trust ya how ilumoyena, born. He shows up. He shows up. So, guys, let us rely and trust and believe in God. Let us not doubt. But at the God, we doubt. We doubt His power. We doubt that He's able. We doubt that He's here. We doubt that His presence is here. So let us not doubt God. Let us just believe. Let us just believe and have faith in this man. Because why? He cares and because He's able. So are, 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 I'll take care of you until your hair is gray. So if we believe that hore lehe ngikawa right now or lehe ngarobe haludu you must always think or mudimu still cares it doesn't mean hore when we go through trials he does not care he still cares so it's our trust it's our faith that moves god to answer us hallelujah somebody so god is always ready to help us God is always ready to help us. God is always ready to listen to us. God is ready to answer us. He's always ready, man. He's always ready. He's just waiting for us. We met the room or Mudimu Gautep. I can say, but what a Mudimu no ga a great seal and a great seal because of help. So let us do our part so that God can be able to do his part in our lives. Hallelujah. Let us do our part so that God can do his part. So, it blesses and I pray and I hope it blesses you or it opens your eyes. And then that we should stop crying. We should stop being um, angry at God. We should stop being upset at God. But we should take the time and just invest it in believing in God, in trusting him. And born, he will come. He will remember us. He will come. He will come. He will come. We make the run of fellow Ramut Sepe come and need. And then whatever we ask in his name, it shall certainly happen. Hallelujah. So just remember that there is no one like God. Even there is there is no one that can ever be like God in this whole world. Uh, we serve a big, awesome, faithful God answering God, who is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all. So hold on. Remember that God cares. You are beautiful. Uh, even in that trial, even in that sickness, even in that impossible situation, remember that God cares and God loves you. Thank you so much for watching. Be blessed and you know, it's hard like a mudimu, arbatle mudimu, asanza na kabona, it's hard like a yena. Um, never let go of him. Never let go of him. He's faithful, he's true. And keep warm. Please keep warm, it's cold. And take care of yourself. And be careful of what you say. Be blessed. This is your girl, the Ria Mulemu girl. Thank you, family.